how to add the subscribe newsletter into the Elementor editor. In this step-by-step -step tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how we can do this. Welcome to Express. My name is Steven, and here I'm going to be showing you how we can do this really, really fast. So the very first thing you want to do is to go into your WordPress, and you have to uh, take your actual Elementor already been opened. As you can see, I'm going to use Elemental.com Academy. So I'm going to just close this one and go into my actual WordPress. In here, as you can see, I have located my actual WordPress. So what I wanted to do now is to take a look into the actual section where I do want it to add a newsletter. Uh, subscribe. I'm going to go into Edit with Elementor. It's going to be popping out this new editor section. So I'm going to click here really, really quick. And what I want to do now into my page is to scroll all the way down and look out for the actual subscribed of the newsletter. So in here, I want to input that here. So what you want to do is to type into your actual keyword command, Control Shift L, or for MacBooks, I'm pretty sure it's going to be Control Command L, and go for blocks. And here into blocks, I want to choose a category. And here I'm going to type newsletter or the subscribe section. So it's going to appear in all these options. I have one, two, three, four, five different options that I can choose. Unfortunately, I need to have a pro version in order to access all of this actual template. So if I choose, let's say, for example, this subscription section like this, it's going to be showing me uh, the actual subscription, your email, as well as subscribed. And there we go. So I think it's going to be really, really great to have this into my actual section, but I need to have an Elementor Pro version. If you don't want to mess around with the Elementor Pro, what you can do is to go into the X mark, go here into the booger, and here I want to type for the actual font. So here, once again, I have the font, but this one is blocked. So I need to have yes or yes, the upgrade version of the Elementor Pro. But let's say that if you want to still do the tutorial for free, I can totally suggest you to just type like a button here. And then I want to type some text editor here and type subscribe here and hit into the click here. So here into the link, you want to send from one place into another one. Of course, it's going to be like uh, a font or whatever. Even you can create a Google form formed here and then what you can do is choose to uh, use this one so you can share this in beam code copy and paste in here into my actual elements or section so this is how we can just do this uh, in a very easy way guys and of course a free way but that's really up to you if you just want to mess around with here or you want to do this on your own actual way so with that being said guys don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more amazing tools about this actual great great app thank you so much for watching the video and with that being said, I hopefully see you next time.